For our purposes in this program, we'll discuss three basic rigging hitches. The single leg, the basket hitch, and the choker. The single leg hitch is the simplest. If the sling you're using, be it chain, wire rope, or webbing, is rated for a certain load capacity, that load capacity is the maximum weight you can hang from this hitch. Exceed the capacity and you run the risk of an accident. A single leg is simple to hook up, but it offers no load control. It's fine for very basic lifting and setting, but don't try to move a load that's suspended by a single leg, unless it's controlled by a tag line. The basket hitch distributes the load between two legs of a sling. A true vertical basket hitch has twice the capacity of a single leg sling. The catchwords there are true vertical basket hitch. This is a true vertical basket hitch. This is not. When you go from this to this, you reduce the capacity of the sling. How much you reduce it depends upon this angle. It's called the horizontal angle. Here's the horizon line. Here's the line of the sling. The angle between them is called the horizontal angle. The smaller or tighter this angle, the more you reduce the load capacity of your sling. To illustrate, the capacity of this single leg sling is 1,000 pounds. That's how much you can hang from it straight down. Take the same sling and make a basket hitch, a true basket hitch. The capacity of that same sling is now 2,000 pounds. That's double the single leg sling. Now connect both ends to a common point. You've just reduced that sling's capacity. When the horizontal angle is at 60 degrees, its capacity drops from twice that of a single leg to 1.7 times that of a single leg. When the angle is 45 degrees, it drops to 1.4 times. And when the angle is 30 degrees, it drops to 1.0 times or the same capacity of a single leg sling. So remember that this angle, the horizontal angle, is important in determining the sling's load capacity.